how to fix error code CE434618 on PlayStation. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Bimo from Guy, and in this guide video, I will simply show you how you can fix the error which says CE434618. But before we get started, as always, if you are new to our channel, do make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. Now, this kind of error usually happens due to a broken update file. So to fix the error, you can delete the broken update file from the notifications queue. So in order to do that, we will simply go to the eye icon, which is the notifications panel. We will select it, and over here, you might have the latest update version which you install of the software. You could tap on the options button and then simply select it from the delete button, and then select it again, and then select that particular broken update file and then delete it and hopefully that will fix the issue the other thing is if you encounter this error after a power surge and having a blu-ray issue then it is very likely that your playstation 4 database gets corrupted and then you can fix this by rebuilding the database in safe mode so you can switch to the safe mode in order to fix it or else what i would recommend you do is simply check for the new updates so you could go to settings basically and you could go ahead and simply select system software update once you select system software update over here you have to go ahead and then look for the new update which you might want to fix and then tap on the ok button to restart your playstation last but not the least you could go to initialization and go to initialize ps4 and then you could do a full wipe or simply a quick wipe in order to delete all of your data from system storage and initialize the ps4 hopefully one of these methods would have worked for you and if it did work for you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and if you have any more questions Questions, queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down below thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video